The Prime Minister says he has serious concerns over Spanish proposals to charge a fee for crossing the border into Gibraltar. The Chief Minister of Gibraltar has accused Spain of sabre-rattling and acting like North Korea in the ongoing dispute over fishing rights. Our diplomatic correspondent Bridget Kendall has more. The Rock of Gibraltar, Britain's tiny outpost on the tip of Spain. After tightened border controls caused traffic chaos a week ago, the row seems to be hotting up. After Spain's foreign minister warned his government might impose new restrictions on traffic and flights in and out of the territory, declaring the party's over. Gibraltar's chief minister this morning was also raising the rhetorical temperature. What we've seen uh, this weekend is sabre rattling of the sort that we haven't seen for some time. You see that the things that Mr. Malagayo has said are more reminiscent of this type of statement you'd hear from North Korea. The threat laid out in a Spanish newspaper interview is still just that, a threat. But one step could be a border crossing fee of 50 euros for each trip between Spain and Gibraltar. Another is tax investigations into property owned by Gibraltarians in Spain and closing Spanish airspace to planes landing at Gibraltar's airport. Downing Street said David Cameron was seriously concerned. And this is what it seems prompted Spanish anger. Concrete blocks tipped into the bay last month by Gibraltar for an artificial reef to encourage marine life. But Spain says the reef is illegal and is ripping the nets of Spanish fishermen. The row over Gibraltar's sovereignty has rumbled on for decades. Britain says it wants this latest spat resolved politically. But Spain has given no indication it's prepared to give way. It could be a long, hot August. Bridget Kendall, BBC News.